Hey there peeps, what's up? Welcome back to Davey have a new uh, type of video, something a little different. So on the live streams, I got somebody asking me to do a mukbang video, and I thought I'd do my own little twist on it and smoke some weed beforehand. Um, I'm not really a hot box, but I definitely want to smoke a little flower here beforehand um, and get this shit going. Um, so I got Carlos Jr. I got a double... Du I got a western bacon, I mean... And I got waffle fries in the I love the waffle fries. Whoa. Those are extra salty, wow. I also got an Oreo shake to wash it down with. Anyways, let's smoke this bowl here and then we'll get to eating. I'll show you guys the food and then we'll eat. Um, right now, I think it's Northern Lights I'm smoking. And I'm smoking the exotic version of it that has a 30% THC. And let me tell you guys, this, this weed slaps. You smoke like one bowl of this shit and you're good for the whole fucking day. I've, I smoked like a couple bowls earlier today at like 11 o'clock and I will keep it high all damn day. Anyways, cheers y'all. <coughs> this is some gas. Always gotta get that pre-dinner appetite going. Definitely hungry. I haven't ate anything today. It's like five o'clock. I haven't really smoked all day either. I smoked a little bit, like from eleven to like one o'clock. I smoked a little bit, <clears throat> but I haven't really smoked anything else since. I haven't ate, so I'm very hungry. Maybe I'll start going to restaurants and doing more of these kind of videos and whatnot. And trying different light items from different restaurants and stuff. Because we have plenty of restaurants to be doing this stuff here. <clears throat> Alright, so I got the Western. Does not look like my burger's burnt, but they definitely put a lot of barbecue sauce on this. Look at this shit. That's like almost way too that's way too much barbecue sauce. I don't know who is making this shit, but they need to be fired. They made this the shakes too thin. I see I'm really picky about when my how my shakes are made. Yeah, I'm really picky about how my shakes are made, you know, they're too thin, I don't like them, if they're too thick, I don't like them. I like them to be just in the middle. Or it's almost like ice cream, but not. Because when I worked at Carl's and shit, I always made, like, the best shakes. I do not know who made this burger, but they put barbecue sauce on the top and the bottom. I've never seen that before.
It's just really good. I think the barbecue sauce covers it a little bit. <clears throat> Definitely hits the spot. <laughs> I was looking at the fries and I just remembered I got really pissed. When I went to Carl's Jr. as a kid, I would get the crisp cut fries with my my kid's meal or whatever. Or even with a regular meal. <clears throat> and it's funny. I, uh, I got mad because they gave me uh, a crisp cut fry and it was like a small size and there was only like three french fries in there. Literally, there were only three french fries in there. So I went back to the kitchen, back to the counter and I just complained, you know. I was like, I'm hungry. You know, how am I going to, how are three fries enough? Even as a kid's meal, you know, they, they should always give you three, more than three french fries. I'm not always a, a huge fan of uh, Carl's Jr. and whatnot. Sometimes their food just tastes like shit. Other times it's fine. I don't know why. <coughs> like when I worked there, I ate... Like, first thing uh, when I got to work, I ate literally a. God, what was it? Fruit. It was the, 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 the California classic cheeseburger with Thousand Island sauce, onions, and cheese. Oh, it's just like a mini version of an In N Out burger, but I remember eating that stuff. And I was so sick my whole entire shift that I could not get through my shift. I was just so sick. Oh. Excuse me. Finish off this burger here and the fries and we'll smoke a little more weed. <clears throat> 